No, 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 wait, wait a minute. I, uh, I have to announce you. Announce me? <coughs> Excuse me, sir. You have a visitor, Dr. Marlene Evans. Sure, sir. Yes, sir. She's already in. I can see that. So, Blondie? What are you doing visiting me? I don't know why you still keep him here. He's my butler. Ralph, why don't you go buttle something? As you wish. You were saying? I was just saying that I don't know why you let that lunatic live in your house. I know it's... Put it this way. He spent a lot of time torturing me. And now I'm torturing you. That's demented. I'm not really, it's actually kind of fun. Maybe I'm just busy. So, I invited you behind my house. You know I've killed people for less. <laughs> Kidding. Maybe not. I just met my mother recently and I never knew my father. Look how I turned out. Exactly. You can move in here too. What? Oh, come on, Mom. Just think it'd be perfect. Then you could spend more time with the twins and, and you could help John yourself. This is not what I sign on for. I say I do. That man is not my husband. What you mean? If I'm a do here, I could help him become a man that he used to be. Thanks to Stephanie, I'm a changed man too. I'm sorry, Mom, but that's okay. I'm getting used to it. Baby's crying every hour. You can't hear those twins on the other side of the mansion. Those high-pitched squeals can resonate ten inches of concrete. <laughs> it would be enough to let Sammy know that I hope to be home for supper. Yes, dear. Bye-bye. your Bobby dinner first, John. Just thinking out loud. What would happen if instead of treating me as a patient, you took me on as a project? I don't know what that means. But we burned a lot of time trying to jumpstart my memories. Maybe we should take a different approach. And what are you suggesting? Why don't you try to turn me into exactly who you want me to be? Ponder that one for a minute. Stefano, make you his little project. Yes. But he didn't look half as good in a dress. <laughs> I hope I look better in a dress. <laughs> you could roll out of bed in house coat and curlers and you would knock my socks off. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. And how I love your hair. And that, that gorgeous smile just melts my heart. I think I've already started without you. And what have you started? Well, I'm 
I'm not sure. But I think we'll figure it out soon enough. Do you want to talk to him? No. Then why are you looking for him? Never mind. Just forget it. Waiting for me to begin to do 